Okay, hi, my name is Vanessa, and usually what I do is when we're just doing a regular daily cleaning and not a deep cleaning, I will usually just spray all my areas down first with the, with the red germicidal soap, spray everything down first as I will go along. And then I will start in the bathrooms. Whenever you're okay. ready. So with the toilets, when you come in, you will spray the all toilets. You spray it all down and around, up under the bottom and everything. And then we will always check for tissue and make sure we have tissue. We will change the sanitary napkin bags to make sure everything's clean. Then you can spray those down and let those six sit. And you will do each toilet that as you go along that way. Spray them down, check for tissue, check for the urinal bags, and spray the, the urinal screen and the tissue holder as you go along in each bathroom. Then after that, you will get your wipe all and just come back. And if you want to, some people like to use bleach too to let it sit because sometimes we may get a ring in there. So we'll use a, um, a Tylex and spread it and let that sit too. And we'll take our Johnny mop. Oh, I'm sorry. We'll take our Johnny mop and we clean it. And we'll take our wipe all and we wipe everything down as we go along. Typically, we throw this away. We don't use the same one for each toilet because you don't want to spread the germs. So we will get another one and continue to do each bathroom as we go along. Then after that, I will go to, to my sinks, clean my sinks. Usually like when I spread down, I would wet it up and then wipe it down because you know it had set for a minute. So you will wipe those down. Always use a different wipe ball. After you finish doing that, you will get your glass cleaner and you spray your glass cleaner on each glass and you wipe them down. You spray all your hands, uh, yeah, hand soap, yes. <laughs> you will clean all those, make sure those need, don't need to be filled. You will wipe down your walls because sometimes when we wash our hands, a lot of our, it, it rolls down, so it gets dirty. So after you do all that, you want to kind of spray that too to make sure all that is clean. And remember, always use a different wipe ball because you don't want to keep pass, you know, transferring the same germ. And over here, then we spray down our changing station because we do have kids that comes in. So you want to spray that down and make sure all that is clean and kind of lift it up because sometimes you don't want a kid come here and hit them. So make sure after you clean it, you lift it back up. Then after you've done all that, usually I will take my Johnny Mop, not my Johnny Mop, my Burma dust pan, and I will sweep up any tissue that we have up in here and then take it out. I will change this bag daily because sometimes we do have dirty diapers. So you never want your garbage to stink. And then you will spray that down with like the German side of soap too, you know, as you go along. Then after that, you pretty much get your mop and your bucket and you mop and you just, that's pretty much it on a daily basis. Now, like if you're deep cleaning, usually like Kelvin showed you in the last, we would use the Kyvac to spray down everything, but we can't do that during the day, so. But other than that, that's pretty much your daily cleaning and you take your trash and you throw everything away. So that's pretty much it you would do as far as daily cleaning, okay?